This is Komaba, Meguroku, Tokyo. Komaba is home to one of the largest university-affiliated institutes in Japan, an institute that mainly carries out research in engineering fields. It is the Institute of Industrial Science of the University of Tokyo. Our institute consists of more than 110 laboratories. More than 1,000 researchers are gathered here from around Japan and all over the world to conduct a wide range of fundamental and applied research. Our research outputs contribute to a brighter future for humankind and our global environment. The campus is located in an attractive green environment which is open to the public. It provides a relaxing and peaceful atmosphere. At the Kashiwa campus, practical experiments and simulations are conducted, making use of the large-scale facilities and vast grounds. These activities are led by LEAP, which stands for Large Scale Experiment and Advanced Analysis Platform. In addition, at the Kashiwa 2 campus, the Design-Led X platform has been established with a linkage to the Komaba campus. Designers and researchers collaborate closely to develop projects that bring the future to life. Since its establishment in 1949, the IIS of the University of Tokyo has deepened knowledge through fundamental research related to engineering. It has also contributed to industrial innovations through applied research. The areas embraced by the Institute of Industrial Science of the University of Tokyo range from microscopic worlds at the quantum level to the human scale world we inhabit and to worlds beyond. From the cities and regions that form the foundations of society, its activities extend to the macro scale occupied by the earth and space. In short, the Institute is involved in almost every aspect of engineering. Each laboratory belongs to one of five departments. Each has multiple research themes. Within a department, multiple laboratories launch joint projects. To achieve common goals, laboratories also establish research centers to collaborate across departments. Researchers communicate freely across divisions and research fields, stimulate each other, and collaborate to increase their practical engineering abilities. コロナ禍により私たちの生活は一変し、現代の科学や技術だけでは強力なウイルスに立ち位置できないことを痛感しました。同時にテレワークやリモート講義などを通じてデジタルトランスフォーメーションの重要性や将来性を身近に感じるよう
今後も私たちは大学の研究所として学術的成果を追求しつつ革新を通じて新たな価値の創造に貢献し続けますこれからも研究成果の実社会の実装を見据えて人文科学と工学を統合する学際的なアプローチを追求する新しい政権スタイルを作り上げていきます。The areas covered by the Department of Fundamental Engineering include the experimental and theoretical physics of soft and nanostructured materials, mechanics, and earthquake engineering. Here, we've successfully developed technologies for the mass production and in flight handling of micro liquid droplets. These are now applied in the fabrication of hybrid microcapsules based on collision processes of multi particles. We produce reinforced plastic based containers wrapped in carbon fiber for ultra high pressure hydrogen gas used by fuel cell vehicles. Based on the results of extensive experiments, they are designed with the strength to resist explosions. Recent development of mechanical exfoliation and van der Waals assembly of atomic layers opened up new possibilities in materials, science, and technology. We're developing novel electronic devices by stacking various atomic layers, such as graphene and 2D materials, in designed sequences. With the aim of achieving safe and comfortable buildings and cities, We conduct research to propose solutions for improving their performance and resilience. The Department of Mechanical and Biofunctional Systems studies mechanical, precision, and ocean engineering. It conducts research into innovative machines, devices, and systems. Three dimensional printing technology can produce functional shapes quickly and precisely. It can be used with multiple materials, including plastics, rubber, and metals. Injection molding technology allows us to freely manufacture new parts from various plastics, rubber, and metal composites. Human life is closely linked to the oceans, which cover 70% of the Earth's surface. To ensure the sustainable use of marine resources, we explore the essence of the ocean's functions and measure and evaluate potential and risks through marine observations. Applied engineering brings together multiple fields, including sensing, platforms, and simulations. The Department of Informatics and Electronics engages in three areas of research information and computer sciences and nano electronics, photonics and very large scale integration, and energy, motion control, and micro machines. We develop remote control robot technologies that use virtual reality. These will meet needs in various areas in the future. We also digitally archive important cultural properties by integrating robot and sensor technologies. Social media are among the most important communication channels. As a result, vast quantities of information are accumulated. We develop technologies that effectively extract and visualize information from the expanse of cyberspace. Life is a complex and self organized system. To understand its principles, we develop algorithms to track dividing cells in developing embryos and figure out the rules and patterns in the process of development. The Department of Materials and Environmental Science conducts extensive research ranging from fundamental studies to advanced material development. We aim to overcome diseases and understand brain development by combining analysis on protein synthesis regulations in neurons with molecular and genetic approaches, and neural tissue engineering 
using micro devices. We research and develop a range of innovative glass production technologies. Based on traditional methods, we've developed production equipment for floating molten glass that prevents it from crystallizing. Through collaborations among several laboratories in various fields, we've developed a radioactive cesium decontamination cloth based on Prussian blue. Because it is easy to produce and handle, this cloth is used for removing radioactive cesium ions. The Department of Human and Social Systems conducts studies on architecture, infrastructure facilities, and urban, regional, and global environments, which are social areas where human beings interact. To solve global issues related to water, we simulate global hydrologic cycles, monitoring climate changes, and investigate the balance between water demands and supplies. We aim to achieve a secure and sustainable society by managing flood risks and water resources. We also conduct research to develop innovative structural systems. Tensegrity Skeleton, one of the most advanced lightweight structures, has been well studied and constructed as a full-scale practical skeleton for the first time in the world to demonstrate our achievements. In order to build capacity for minimizing the damages caused by disasters and for protecting human lives, the Disaster Management Training Center provides training for knowledge and skills for management of disaster response based on the theory and technology of disaster preparedness. The Institute of Industrial Science has research centers for strategically important project research, as well as laboratories specializing in different fields that collaborate flexibly. Here, we are exploring ultra-small light emitters that move freely, guided by tiny ultrasound forces. Gesture-controlled free space optical networks and drug-loaded microneedles, less than 50 micrometers in diameter, that allow absorption directly through the skin. At the forefront of advanced science. Using the latest supercomputers, we perform highly accurate simulations on the effects of the fluid dynamics of water or air on vehicles, ships, and aircraft wings. At the Nanoscience Center, where we study nanoscale interactions between light and matter, we are developing nanostructure devices that respond to terahertz electromagnetic waves. Holograms using redistribution of photopolymer molecules according to light intensity distribution. And technology for solar cells and hydrogen evolution by converting light energy with nanoparticle photocatalysts. Tackling new frontiers of science and technologies. We will open up engineering by creating unprecedented contact with society and the public using the methods of science communication. We extract latent issues through surveys of groups that are sensitive to specific issues and through research in regions where social issues are likely to become apparent. The Institute of Industrial Science contributes to communities through industry collaborations. We return our research outputs to society by working not only with industry, but also with national and local governments. In an era of big data, we promote ITS research to achieve a mobility society, integrating engineering fields such as transport, vehicles, and information technologies and conduct research in collaboration with academic, public, and private sectors. The automated driving bus pilot deployment project at Kashiwa City 
is moving towards safe and sustainable mobility. We're engaged in a reconstruction project for the Tohoku area, which was affected by the Great East Japan earthquake. The positions and shapes of architectures are measured using a sensing vehicle equipped with omnidirectional cameras and laser sensors. A consortium established by aircraft makers located mainly in Japan and the United States is developing innovative technologies for manufacturing aircraft. It is working on cutting-edge technologies for carbon fiber composite materials and titanium alloys. The Kama House, built on the Komaba campus, is used as a platform to perform research experiments for various companies. As a leader in the engineering field with excellent manufacturing technologies, we aim to create new design-based values by fusing aesthetic senses in areas such as sports. The Office for the Next Generation, ONG, aims to introduce the latest science and technologies into elementary and secondary education by cooperating with industries. This institute, where a number of international researchers are enrolled, promotes international collaborative studies and academic exchanges, and has signed many international exchange agreements with various institutions around the world. The Laboratory for Integrated Micro-Mechatronic Systems collaborates in international research with the CNRS in France. The aim is to explore new frontiers in nanotechnology, biomems, and advanced mems. The New York office promotes collaborative research with universities and industries in the United States and organizes international symposia. The Institute of Industrial Science of the University of Tokyo, as one of the world's top institutes in the field of engineering, is committed to being a dynamic intellectual institute that creates practical knowledge together with society.